Hello and welcome back to another SQL tutorial. This is video number 12 of the series. We are learning SQL, a structured query language. And in last video, we learned how to use this web-based application uh, from Oracle to connect to database. And also we created a, an object, second object of our, of our database, PH, which is also a table. We also learned how to apply some constraints to individual columns of this uh, table. Now, if I run this command, there is no data in this table at the moment. I want to create another object, another database object type, which is known as sequence. So, currently, this schema has two objects. Schema, this is the name of the schema. Schema is simply a collection of related database objects. In Oracle, when you create a user, you also create a schema. This is not true for other products, but uh, Oracle, uh, in Oracle, it's a bit simple. You create a user, the schema is already created for you. And the all, all objects that are created under that user, by that user, are under one schema. So we want to create another database object and we want to use that object to insert serial, serial numbers automatically into the phone. I'll show you what I mean. Let me create it first. Create sequence. The, this is the command. Create sequence, the statement. And name of the object is ABC, for example. It has to have a number. You start with, I want my numbers to start with 2000 and increment by five. So first number would be 2000 in this sequence. The second number would be 2005, 2010. And we'll use this sequence number uh, to insert values into serial number column of our phone table. Currently, this table does not have any data. So we'll run this. Sequence created. If you look at the catalog right now, it has three objects. Two of them are table and the third one is sequence. Now we want to insert data with the help of this object into our ph table and the command is insert into ph and we want to choose columns sno name uh, p number was the third column and the last one was address address values and we want to say values uh, bracket open ABC next well so that's how you insert this is the name of the sequence this is the next value of the sequence Michael for example comma is a separator phone number for Michael maybe this is the number and the last one is address maybe Japan and bracket close semicolon and let me check if everything is right ABC next well Michael so we'll select this and we'll run this one row inserted if you look at this table now the serial number is 2000 name is Michael so this is the number that was generated by this sequence you can also so look at the ABC next well from dual this next value should be 2005 2005 okay so you can insert another value you can change these values I'll say Madonna and the phone number for Madonna is uh, maybe and her country is South Africa and we can run this command again uh, not this one one row inserted look at the data once again and it now has so we've used this value already so we used uh, we have used one value okay in when you're using sequence it is always possible to have some missing values and that apparently that does not seem to be a problem so it's this is primary key it cannot have a duplicate number but missing a value 
uh, doesn't seem to be a problem in actual practice. So we have used this value here. Uh, if we insert another name, uh, Britney Spears, awesome. we'll change the number and we'll say Russia and we can insert another row okay look at the data once again and this is 2015 thank you very much that's how you create a sequence and that's how you insert a value with the help of a sequence into another object thank you very much